What is good, everybody? Hey, what's up? Um, it's your boy Sipistado here, and I am bringing you with Pokemon Giovanni Origins. Now, just off the name itself, we can already tell what kind of game this is gonna be. So this is gonna be really a origin story on Giovanni, you know, big boss of Team Rocket. Um, this, so basically, this is gonna take place way back before Team Rocket was even a thought. I guess it's taking place like way back before fucking Giovanni even met Professor Oak too. Not too sure, but oh shit, who was that? Okay, commence tape recording. <clears throat> this is interview 66 for case 17B. For my own safety, I cannot state my name in front of the suspect. Instead, I'll identify only as Detective Delta 4. What a bitch ass name, bro. What kind of Detective Delta 4? Not 24, not um, um, big A, big six, nothing like that. I'm interviewing case suspect number 23. Who are we? Are we that one dude off on of Pokemon Apollo? <laughs> um, interview commencing. Oh, what's good? 20? You're a detective, nigga? You look more like a cop to me. And what's that behind your back? Big at Is that like a Pokeball or... And can you please move that flashlight up out my eyes, bro? Like, I already got bad astigmatism and everything, nigga. It looks like your luck finally ran out, didn't it? <laughs> it's about time, too. Now, before this interview can even proceed, please state your name on the tape. Nice and clear. And not your silly little lies, too. I want your real name, boy. <clears throat> oh, shit. Oh, we're not Giovanni. Who is this nigga? I want to get myself, you know, a cool-ass name. Something that's Cantonian. Who? What's Cantonian? Let's see. There's Oak, Giovanni, Serge. Er I'm, I'm just going to go with, like... You know what? Since it was, like, back in the Cantonian era... And not a lot of people have, like, the craziest names, like, you know, Serge, Erica, Oak, bitch, like, Gary, come on, bitch, I'm gonna go with Dale, bro, like, what the fuck, and I look like a Dale, too, Dale, did I hear that correctly, yeah, Dale, very good, you can follow basic commands, at least, hey, bitch, what you mean, by look, this is the thing about, like, 12, 12 be, like, rude sometimes for no reason, now then, we both know why you're here, but you're not the real prize, Dale. Let's be honest. No, <laughs> you're an invaluable, sure, but the real prize? That'll be Giovanni, the criminal, ma ma <clears throat> the criminal mastermind behind Team Rocket. Your friend, right? <laughs> Somebody you know very well? <laughs> Somebody you would consider perhaps even to be your closest friend? Or so you thought. You see, Dale, Giovanni himself is the reason it's you here today instead of him. What? Nah, nah, this that one, this that thing that they be trying, they trying to get me to snitch and shit. Um, I know what they doing. You're but a small fish compared to that shark, Giovanni. But you have a choice though. You can help us catch the shark, yeah? <laughs> Take him down once and for all, and in exchange you get to walk free and integrate yourself back into society like nobody you are. Hey bitch, hold on, first of all, if you want shit for me you gotta treat me with like respect nigga because you're not gonna get shit from me if you're talking to me like that and i'm not even no snitch too so you're not even gonna get shit out of me after all <laughs> you two were childhood friends right you grew up together in saffron city in kanto isn't that right dale no that's not true i actually grew up um in saruk city over at johto uh but i teach their own you know giovanni better than anybody else and i want to hear everything I want every single detail of that man's life. From the moment you became friends to the man he's grown into today. And don't worry, <laughs> I have all the time in the world, so don't you go leaving out any details, alright? Let me whip out my little fucking pen and notepad. And I'm ready for you. I'll tell you what, boy. Let's start with the day you and Giovanni first got your hands on your very first Pokemon. Speak clearly now. The tape's recording. Oh, he's using the tape recorder. He's not actually writing it down. My bad. That was like the sound. That was supposed to be the sound of like a fucking tape recorder like pressing record roughly 20 years ago. Hey, hey, hey. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, what's this? Dun, dun, dun. I should really start keeping a journal. Yeah, you, yeah, well, you got one right there, cuz. What you talking about? What is this? Rocket Industries? What's up, moms? You got nothing to tell me? Oh, oh, Dell. Before you head out, I got a little gift for you. Oh, shit. You mentioned how you liked that pair of, um, trainers you saw last week, so I thought I'd treat you. Oh, she got- Oh, shit. Hey, thanks, mommy. You got me some nice J's? Okay. These are new shits. The Azuls. I don't know if they had that in Kanto. Um, uh, she said to tell Giovanni hi. What's good, big old Saffron? What's up, baby girl? 
And I remember, it's not Z. I can't believe how popular battling Pokemon is becoming. I forgot, this is 20 years in the fucking past. Holy shit, look at Saffron City, y'all. I didn't even realize that. Don't bloody Pidgey have eaten all me berry stock. You serious? Hey, <laughs> hey, that's on you, bro. Let's look inside. Empty, like my head. I don't even know why I checked that shit out. Look, it's the bike shop. Hey, so this is where fucking... What, what? The gym? What the fuck? What kind of gym this is? Work? Hey, what's good? Oh, hold on. Oh, wait, what type of gym this is? Hey, cuz, you can see this building is a Pokemon gym. If you manage to defeat the gym leader of the Pokemon gym, they'll give you a Kamara gym badge. No, they won't. That guy is not no gym leader. He's a fraud. Um, I think we're supposed to be looking for fucking Giovanni or some shit. Big G, hey, um, excuse me, what are you doing? Oh, I know who you are. <laughs> You're Giovanni's new little friend. Ch I'm Giovanni's mother, but you may and will call me madam. What the fuck? I suppose you're here looking for my son then, are you? Well, I'm afraid he's not here. He's out somewhere, wasting his life away. No doubt wasting his time with his silly little dreams of becoming a world-renowned Pokemon trainer, just like his pathetic father. Oh shit. Damn, she, like y'all living in Saffron City, nice-ass place? He should be coming to work with me. I have built my very own business from the ground up and Giovanni has his life set out for him on a silver platter. If you find him, tell him that his mother wants to see him immediately. Hey, I mean, look, listen, don't force him to not... I'm sorry, madam. I'm not gonna put myself in, like, fucking family business like that. Oh, shit, is this Silphco? Oh, shit, this is Silphco before it was even Silp... Oh, 12, I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, you ain't gonna have to, like... Tell me all that. Let's look inside. Oh, we got an antidote? Nice. Why is there always an antidote in like the first cities, bro? Like that shit make no sense to me. I never get poisoned when I, as soon as I hit route route one, I never get poisoned. Or anything like, you're you're a fucking bug trainer. You have oh hey Giovanni, hey Dale, check it out. The Saffron City Pokemon Gym. They say that the gym leader Bruno. Oh shit, Bruno. Oh, is one of the hottest up-and-coming Pokemon trainers on the scene. With his grit and determination, people are tipping him to be the future member of the Elite Four, or even possibly the Pokemon Champion. Oh shit! Ha! This chump can't achieve that. Then why can't we? Yeah, you're right, nigga. Imagine running your own gym leader. Your Imagine running your own Pokemon gym and battling with some of the scariest and most powerful Pokemon by your side. That's what I want to be. The ultimate Pokemon trainer, the ultimate champion. Mom won't let me have my own Pokemon until I start going to work with her and helping her run her business. But forget that, I have other plans. Some rich bozo just opened up a new research HQ in the city, a place called Self Corporation. Have you heard of it? Question mark. No, I haven't. Apparently, this place is stacked with fucking Pokemon. And what do we need? Huh? Exactly that, nigga. We need some Pokemon. Um, you want your own Pokemon too, right, Dale? Then how about this? Let's go and get us some fucking Pokemon. Nobody ain't nobody telling us no, nigga. Like nobody telling us no, bro. Meet me out in front of the Silph Co building and don't keep me waiting, bro. Oh hell no. So we gotta go steal Pokemon? Cool. I mean, no, wait, no, it's not cool to steal, bro. Listen, I would never steal if I was living in the Pokemon world, I'll never steal Pokemon. You good? You tend to your little gardens, bro? I don't even care. I would never steal Pokemon. Dale, you made it. Nice. Um, uh, what bland ass fucking comment, nigga? Like what the fuck? Now. We need to get inside, but this fool on the door won't let us through. We need a distraction of some sort. Hmm. I got it. Maybe that fat nigga. Oh, just tell the guard that you heard that fat guy over there talking about robbing the place, yeah? As soon as the guard moves away from the door to question him, we sneak in. Easy. Walk right up to the door and do it. So we can get in as quick as possible, nigga. Trust that. Okay, so, hey, 12, listen, sorry, but this is a private. No, 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 trust me. What's that? Plans of robbery? Are you sure? Not on my watch, I'll deal with this. Hey, you, excuse me, sir. Oh, me? Oh, no, am I in trouble? What are you hanging around for? Come on. Oh, shit, my bad, Sasuke or some shit. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Ah, ooh, I love this shit. Oh my God, this is the one reason I love fucking Pokemon XD. Psst, Dale. Okay, stay low and keep quiet. We don't want to get caught, all right? These three niggas are getting they shits or something like that? What is that? Let's see if we can find a PC. I know where most people store their Pokemon. Oh, shit. Let's go this way and remember. Shh. Oh, shit. Hey, hey. Is that a Voltor? Hey, let's see here. Hey, check it out. PC. And it's unlocked. I'm gonna get me a Pokemon. Keep a lookout, will you? Oh, Oh, that's Mr. Sylph. What's good? And that is why I'm seeking your investment today. 
The Sylph Corporation aims to be the largest manufacturer and distributor of many household Pokemon items. Anything from basic medicines to Pokeballs, escape ropes, to technical machines, we'll do it all. With your investment, I would like to open many Pokemons across the entirety of Kanto, Johto, Hoenn, even, and even beyond, honestly. What is it, Shark? Uh, what's that shit? Shark bait? Or that shark, sh that shark shit? Shark show? And our ultimate goal? We are on the brink of creating the world's first Master Ball. A type of Pokemon which would never fail to catch a Pokemon. Oh shit. I need about like 99 of those. I wonder how I can do that. CE? Question mark? <laughs> this would cement Silph Coat on the world map and your return on investment would be through the metaphorical roof. Dale, pay attention. It's your turn. Come on. I'll keep lookout. What they got? What they got? Oh, Bulbasaur, Squirtle, Charmander, or Pikachu? They got nothing else better? This was like way back, way back before Cancel was even crazy, bro. Like, niggas would not have Charmander, Squirtle, Bulbasaur, or P um Niggas would have Pikachu. That's obvious because, like, Pikachus are outside. But nobody would have these three right here. What would I want to look like? I want to be like the first nigga in Kanto that would have the, you know what, bitch, Charmander, what the fuck? I want to have, I want to be like the first nigga in Kanto that would have like the scariest fucking team. That would like make a nigga like shit they pants as soon as they fucking, well, I did get caught in the end somehow. But still, I want to be that trainer, you feel me? And you know what, I'm going to call this nigga something cool like Zare. They'll, they'll be like, hey, Dale is coming with his Zare. Oh shit, I think I should have gave him a better fucking nickname. Fuck, um, you're done? Question mark? Great. Now let's get out of here. Hey, hold it right there. Uh-oh. Well, what do we have here, huh? I suppose you thought your little distracting worked out front? <laughs> well, it looks like your little scheme backfired. And what are those Pokeballs in your hands? I don't suppose those Pokemon are the property of Silphco by any chance? You two are coming with me. Silph himself can decide what he wants to do with you. Follow me now. This was your fault, Dale. Bitch, what did I do? What took you so long to decide? Look, listen, I had to make sure that I wasn't, that was like, <clears throat> I think that's all your fault. You should have not, excuse me, sir. Sorry to interrupt you, but this couldn't wait. Oh, this is most unexpected. What is it, officer? I caught these two dickheads right here trespassing on the property, and it appears that they each have stolen a Pokemon from your PC. Do you two hooligans wish to explain yourselves? <laughs> Please, we're really sorry. We just wanted to be Pokemon trainers like everybody else. We always see the Pokemon trainers on TV, but our families. They could never afford to buy us Pokemon of our own. I wouldn't listen to this bullshit if I were you. Trust me, I recommend the maximum punishment. I can escort these stupid asses to the police station right now. No, <clears throat> that would not be necessary. These two young dickheads right here are simply pursuing their dreams. Who knows what amazing and wonderful things that they that will go on when they fucking achieve their dreams with their Pokemon by their side. Future gym leaders, perhaps, maybe even the fucking gym, um, gym four. I was about to say gym four. <laughs> maybe they will head up an international organization of some sort or land a leading role in modern science. Who knows what you pair have done today is wrong, but I can tell that your intentions are good and pure. Just as I planned, oh my god, it's this fucking background music, bro. This shit does not make this shit that serious. Ooh, wee. That is why I will allow you to keep the Pokemon you stole today. Just promise me one thing though. Just promise me that you'll use your Pokemon for good and not for bad. That you'll do your best to help others and help them achieve their goals as well. Spread a positive message and fight the criminalization of Pokemon wherever you go. In fact, take this. It's a Sylph Co. starter kit. These are still in prototype, so consider yourselves very lucky. Bitch, I, if, if I was in this situation, bro, that should just be... I'll be five... You're only gonna do five. You're not gonna do like ten or anything. Fresh water. Oh, thank you. I was actually kind of parched. Now, I have a presentation to finish. Oh, my bad, sir. Twin, you're excused and forgiven. You little sob story rats may have worked on Sylph, but not on me. You are very lucky today, kids. <laughs> now get out of my sight. You'll never step foot inside Sylphco again. Not as long as I guard that door. Bitch, okay, nigga. Hey, <laughs> Dale, I can't believe it. We pulled it off. We did. 
in front of the fucking police officer Giovanni? You gonna say that? Cuz is like, and you're screaming this shit out. I can't believe that self idiot bought my sob story. Too easy, really. In front of Cuz right there, like we just got off scotch free. Now we can like, and he's not gonna do or say nothing, bro. Like, hello, okay. <laughs> Say, let's see who picked the better Pokemon. Prepare yourself for a world of pain, Dale. Are you dead ass? We just got... And this... And why he... Why are you suited up? You young! How old is this nigga? You're looking about like 48 right now. Hot... Wait, what, bitch? You mean to tell me... I had the choice Bulbasaur, Squirtle, Charmander, maybe Pikachu... Th the most fucking war advanced craziest fucking Pokemon that these dickheads around the 20 years before they even became like um what it is today that people don't even know of and this nigga chose Meowth a basic ass Pokemon you can find on Route 5 all right later bro fake out god damn he got my ass um wait a minute hold up wait bro chill wait oh my god wait Come on, Meowth, bring the pain. He's burned. Hold on. He's burned. No. Oh, no. Fresh water. Fresh water. Get fucked, idiot. Um. Later, bro. Easy as fuck. Yeah, he got cheese, bro. Yo, I forgot we got the fresh water, bitch. I was starting to panic. Because he got two clean shits off of me, bro. I don't know how he did this shit. But give me my level six, though. Thank you. Okay, clap. I don't get no two levels. No way. You should give me your Pokemon, man. Huh. Bitch. You got me fu- Hey, listen. You're not gonna pull that Team Rocket bullshit off on me. Trust me. Um, okay, Dale. We should head south of South Brown City and make our way to Vermilion City. There's a gym there that, um... There's a gym there that we should challenge. That'll be a true test of who's the better Pokemon trainer. Oh, and do me a favor. Don't tell my mother about the Pokemon or our little adventure, alright? She's been nagging to me about fucking helping her out with the family business and all that other fun, stupid, boring, lame shit. But getting a normal job sounds boring. Yeah, being a Pokemon trainer illegally with the way that we got our Pokemon is fun. I just want to battle, catch, and train Pokemon. I'm going to assemble a team of fucking the most powerful, fiercest Pokemon that anybody has ever seen. Okay, let the race begin. Yo, don't you worry, Nick. I'm going to bring my same team. My team is going to be dangerous, powerful, scary as fuck. Wait, y'all can't see me. My team is going to be scary as fuck. I'm talking Gengar. I'm talking the craziest team. But we will never know until we find out um, with, like, the fucking next episodes. Who knows? Maybe next episode we'll end up fucking catching, like, a goddamn Caterpie or a Meowth. <laughs> Who knows? We're Giovanni's best friend, and this is the end of episode one. If y'all like this episode, um, or if y'all like the game so far, leave a like down below. I will also leave a, a download link in the description below to download this demo. It actually is in a demo form. It's not a full game release. But if y'all want to play it, it'll be right there. Um, I'm going to catch you on the next episode. Definitely want to keep playing more of this because this shit's getting like kind of fun and exciting. I'm going to catch y'all. Peace.